Hi everybody and welcome back to my channel. For those of you new here, hello, my name is Skylar. I am a certified dog trainer and pet nutritionist. Today I'm going to be answering some of the most frequently asked questions about pet CBD products. I personally am a huge fan of pet CBD products and I have been for years now. All three of my dogs use CBD products for different reasons. Uh, most namely, I have a 16 and a half year old dog. He was my childhood dog and he gets CBD twice a day, every single day, to help manage his doggy dementia, as well as his arthritis. Over the past four years, I've been experimenting on my own with pet CBD products, looking into the limited research that is available to us, talking to veterinarians about CBD products, talking to CBD makers about pet CBD products, working with my own dogs, my clients' dogs, and seeing how those interact with each individual dog case by case. With that, I found that a lot of pets really do benefit from the addition of a CBD product to help manage different things. This doesn't mean it's a cure-all and it doesn't mean that every single animal or every single pet that you give CBD to is going to have a drastic change, but it is worth trying if it's something that you think will be beneficial. Worst case scenario, it doesn't work out how you'd like you can move on, try something else. Since I do recommend CBD products to clients, and again, I use them for my own pets, I do get a lot of questions about CBD products, and because they're so new on the market, there are a lot of questions that deserve answers. Before we get into the frequently asked questions, I wanna say a big thank you to today's video sponsor, Austin & Cat. Austin & Cat truly makes a great CBD product, I really like that it's not only the CBD that's helping to create all of these benefits for your pets, but they also add additional herbs to help boost different benefits. This one, for example, is the Austin and Cat Hemp with Coconut Oil. It has black pepper extract, which helps to enhance the absorption and bioactivity of the CBD, as well as CoQ10, which provides antioxidants that support the heart and nervous system. The one that I have in particular is geared towards multi-pet households or large dogs both of which apply to me. This one is a 600 milligram CBD, which means that you can feed a little bit less of it, save a little bit of money over time, and just make it much more bang for your buck. I was also sent the Harper's Immunity Plus formula to try out. This formula contains 450 milligrams of CBD per bottle, but also contains additional immune boosters, like turkey tail mushrooms and Indian ginseng. One of the things that I also really like about the Austin and Cat CBD oils compared to some of the other oils that I've tried is that they use coconut oil as their base. You can't really just have the super concentrated CBD oil and expect that to be easy for the average person to use with their pets. So these oils are often diluted into another oil to make it easier for you to administer to your pet. I've come across a lot of CBD oils that use olive oil as their base, which is fine but I do much prefer the coconut oil base, I do have to say that. I'm also a big fan of companies that give you information with the products. I think that's super handy to immediately pull the product out of the box and whoa, hey, there's some information so you actually know what you're looking at and how to use it. And Austin and Cat, super cute art style, their packaging is absolutely the cutest thing ever. It's the first thing that I noticed when I opened this box but they have super easy beginner's guide to dosage based on their dropper sizes and their formulations. They also give you some helpful tips about how to keep the CBD working the best it possibly can, like using it the same time of day and incorporating it daily so that it has built up benefit. It even has this super cute little card that tells you who packed your order. So uh, thanks Courtney, that was awesome. And I think this is a super cute personal touch. Because CBD products are still relatively new on the market, they can sometimes be a little difficult to find. So being able to just go onto their website and buy some pet CBD products that's gonna work best for your pet, that's awesome. Super easy, takes a lot of that guesswork out of it. They also have a ton of other formulations besides just the ones that I have. They have the Immunity Boost, they have a hip and joint one, they have a calming product, and they also have one specifically for seniors. Now that you know of a great brand that you can get CBD products from, Let's actually answer some of those frequently asked questions you have about them. First and foremost, what is CBD? CBD, which is short for cannabinoidal, is a chemical compound found in the cannabis sativa plant. You might be more familiar by its name as marijuana or hemp. Hemp plants can be bred to have more or less of different chemical compounds depending on the purpose of what it's being cultivated for. For example, hemp plants that are grown for its medical benefits typically will have a higher level of CBD and a lower level of THC, which is the chemical compound that gives marijuana its psychotropic qualities. What can CBD help? CBD may help with a variety of ailments, 
like anxiety, joint pain, arthritis, inflammation, seizures, and much more. CBD can be used daily as relief for general anxiety or the pain and inflammation associated with arthritis, or it can be used in more specific circumstances like anxiety during car rides or the 4th of July, or right after a surgery or a minor injury. What is the difference between hemp seed oil and hemp oil? In short, hemp seed oil comes from the seeds of the hemp plant, whereas hemp oil or CBD comes from the stalks, flowers, and leaves. Hemp seed oil does not contain any CBD, but it does contain beneficial fatty acids, nutrients, and bioactive compounds that do carry their own benefits. Hemp oil is also made of similar nutrients, fatty acids, and compounds, but also contain varying levels of CBD depending on the strain of hemp that the individual product and company is using. Will CBD get my pet high? This is one of the top two questions that I get all the time when it comes to CBD products for pets. And the short answer is no, your pet will not get high and they wouldn't enjoy it at all if they did. CBD is derived from hemp that is bred for its medical properties, not the psychotropic. In fact, THC, the psychotropic element of marijuana, can actually be toxic for pets. CBD products that are intended to be consumed by pets have nearly untraceable levels of THC, which makes them perfectly healthy and safe for pets to take. How do I get my pet to take CBD? This really depends on the kind of CBD that you are using. CBD treats, you can just give as is and incorporate into their daily schedule. CBD oils, like the ones from Austin and Cat, are best administered directly in the back of your pet's cheek, not straight down their throat. If you have to use food to administer CBD oils, it's best to do it in a really small quantity, like a spoonful of peanut butter, canned dog food, pumpkin puree, something that you can mix it in with and then ensure that your pet's actually gonna eat all of it. Should you give your pet CBD with food? Yes and no. Some studies have shown that when CBD is given with a full meal, it's harder for the body to absorb all of the CBD, which makes it less effective. For this reason, I recommend giving CBD either an hour before or an hour after your pet's meal. If you must use food to administer the CBD, again, it's best to do it in a really small quantity to ensure that your pet is getting all of it in one dose without diluting the effects at all. Otherwise, CBD oils can go directly into the back of the cheek and CBD treats can just be fed as is. The other of the top two most common questions I get about pet CBD products is, can my pet overdose on this? And again, simple answer, no. Even if your pet were to eat your whole bag of treats or drink the whole vial of CBD oils in one sitting, worst case scenario, they're gonna take a nice nap and they might have some loose stools the next day. But other than that, they should be fine. If you have any concerns, you can always take your pets to the vet and have them get a checkup that way. How much CBD should I be giving my pet? The average dose for CBD is typically one milligram of CBD per 10 pounds of body weight. Each CBD product's dosage is gonna vary based on the concentration of the CBD oil and the way that it's administered, whether it be a cookie, an oil, a chewable powder, whatever. That being said, each pet is an individual and may need more or less depending on how they react to it and their metabolism speed. For this reason, it's best to start with a low dose and then build up as needed until you're getting the desired effects. Remember, your pet isn't gonna overdose on CBD, so if you feel like you're feeding a lot to try to get them to the dosage that they need, you might need to find a product with a higher concentration of CBD. Last but not least, how long will it take for the CBD to take effect? The activation time of CBD is gonna really depend on your pet. For some, it might take 45 minutes, for some, it might take an hour and a half or even more. If after about an hour, you're seeing absolutely no difference, you can give them an additional dose about half the size of the original and see if that helps. Thank you for watching today's video. I hope that you enjoyed it and I hope that you learned something. If you've experienced using pet CBD products, please leave those down in the comments below, whether they were good, bad, your favorite products, things that you still wanna know, let me know and we can definitely kind of learn from each other down there in the comment section. Again, a really big thank you to Austin and Kat for sponsoring today's video. I really appreciate it. Despite, you know, marijuana and hemp being totally legal in my state, YouTube doesn't like to push this content, which I get. But also, I it hurts a little bit to have videos demonetized because that doesn't happen super often for me. So thanks for watching this far into the video. Please be sure to like this video so that can hopefully reach a few more people who may be interested in learning more about pet CBD products, as well as subscribing to my channel if you haven't already. I do a ton of different pet related videos, primarily training and nutrition. So if those interest you, please 
join the family, hang out, watch a video or two, see what you think. You can also follow me on social media. I'm on Instagram at tattoo.dogtrainer and at topdogbehavior. That one's the one I'm admittedly way more active on. That is my business account, and there I share pretty much daily infographics, information, shareable content, free training information, free nutrition information. It's a really great resource, and I think it's worth checking out if that's something that you're interested in. Once again, thank you for watching, and I will see you in my next video. Bye!